God, a full scale look like an anime or something. Hi everyone, welcome back to the quarantine series. I am genuinely making that a thing, right? I've kind of made like a wee goal that I'll do one YouTube video a week for the rest of quarantine. With all this spare time on my hands, like I don't really have a reason not to and I'm really enjoying just making videos again. So, sorry, before we go any further, I, can I just apologise and ask you to not mind what I look like right now? Sorry, this fake tan. <sighs> That's nasty. This is my Fitbit that causes this. My hands are just disgusting. My tan needs redone, my hair needs washed, I'm missing a few nails, my eyebrows have eyebrows of their own. We are in quarantine at the end of the day, who is keeping on top of this shit? Not me. Anyway, um, today's quarantine series brings you... A haul! Over the past couple of weeks I was like, do you know what, I'm going to cheer myself up a bit. Like, I never go online and do like a big shop and spend like a large sum of money. I always buy like one or two things. I was like, fuck it, let's just go like treat yourself, all that. I bought stuff off Nike, ASOS and Urban Outfit. And I thought I maybe spent like £200. That was kind of what I was like aiming. I looked at my bank and I was like, what, what the fuck? I had like no, I literally had no money. Like, oh my god, what? Happened. It turns out I spent £500. That's so bad. I am never going to financially recover from this. That is a lot of money to me. Like, I work and earn basically minimum wage, right? And I made a lot of money and I'm very proud of it. I do not have a lot of income to splash about. For a like spontaneous shop, that £500 was just not a smart move. Spent a few days convincing myself that I deserved to spend £500. I'm going to keep it all, I'm not sending anything back. So, let's see what I spent £500 on. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine and you're not really fine. Right, first I'll start with the Urban Outfitters stuff, right? And I love Urban Outfitters, but I just don't buy from it enough. I always have in mind that it's like really expensive, but see, to be fair, for what I spent on Urban Outfitters, I actually got quite a lot. And their stuff's just so funky, so absolutely love that. This hoodie is a bit of me. I'm actually obsessed with this hoodie. So it's tie-dye. I've hopped on that trend like there's no tomorrow. I can love tie-dye. I just think it's sweet. sweet. That wee brand or where, where is it? I don't really know how you say it. Uh, I eat strands. I eat strands. I eat strands. I don't know. That anyway. And I just love the colours on this. Like these, these are just so nice. Like orange, green, blue. Purpley pink. Absolutely love it. Um, I actually put up a picture wearing this hoodie and people were going pretty mad for it and I totally can see why. Honestly, can't rate this enough. Wear this with like joggies, shorts, anything like that. It'll be great for jumping down to Tesco and you're going to turn some heads in Tesco with this sweatshirt. Okay, so next up, I've not opened this yet. So this is like a wee cord, so it's got two pieces to it. And again, this is from that wee brand. I eat strands. Okay, so these are joggies. Oh, wow, wow, wow. If I was a jogger, I'd be these. Oh, love them. Like, look at the, look at the print on this, guys. Woo, 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 woo. Oh, that's so nice. So these are like pink. We tinges of kind of yellow in there, blue, grey, green. Mwah. Love, and with the pink hair as well. Oh yeah. Oh, lush. Here's a matching jumper. Again, it's just the exact same print, same colours. Got the wee branding up there. Um, now the jumper actually has a wee like toggle thing. When you pull it, you can tighten it, or you can like loosen it. Mm -hmm. Together will just be absolute scenes. I think that will just be so nice. That with like a pair of Air Force. Oh, mwah. lovely. Thing is with these, you can wear them together, absolutely. But you can also wear them separately and get extra use out of them. Sweet. You could either be scrunchy to the wrist. Big shout out to MJ Rob, scrunchy queen. <coughs> be so nice with just some plain joggers. Like I could even wear it with like these white joggers that I have on right now. Can you not see how much of a look that is? Yes, I think so. If I was a tracksuit, ladies and gents, I would be this. Sorry, we're actually 0141 on one with a tie-dye. This top, oh, 
Love it. But look how big that looks. <laughs> I posted the picture in this as well the other day. It goes really well with the pink hair. I really like it with the pink hair. It, these colours are just gorgeous. Pure pastel-y. Green, blue, pink, yellow. And it says celestial plain. Not sure what that means. Be true to yourself on the bottom of it, which I think is just so lovely. What a positive message to be wearing on your body. I had this on with wee shorts. Um, I think it's so nice because it's like proper oversized. It's almost like a t-shirt dress. This is a really great item to take on holiday and shove over a bikini. Oh, that would be so nice. Just picture okay. it, right? <laughs> On holiday when Corona is no longer around in Spain, you came out the pool, you dried off, just got a wee bikini on, you throw this on all over, shove your hair up in a wee bun, slip your feet into some sliders, click it to clock over at the bar, buy a slush puppy, maybe a wee magnum if you fancy it. Oh, roll on those days. This will be coming with me to Ibiza whenever I go. So next up from Urban Outfitters, um, I've got two little vests. Vests are probably my favourite kind of top at the moment. I think they're so simple. They look so effortless yet so effective. Actually can't be a wee vest. I know it's not everyone's cup of tea right but I think it's so nice when you wear a vest and you can see like a wee bit of nipple through it. I know that's a bit too much, maybe a bit provocative. Hashtag free the nap. I personally think it's really cute. This wee vest in lilac. This colour is lovely. Actually, I've also got it in yellow. I, I just couldn't keep that from you guys. You'll see it in a second. Yellow and lilac are my favourite colours. So I couldn't resist. So cute. It's so simple. So plain. But, yeah. Love it. This colour is so cute. Oh, God. Harry gave me such a fright. So some shorts. This with some joggies. Oh, vests are just so versatile. Absolutely love a vest. Okay, so again, I've just got the same little vest in this yellow colour. It looks like really, really bright on here, but it is like actually pure pastel, like kind of lemon. The tan is just banging. Again, just on with some joggies, jeans, shorts, you name it, this will go with it. Okay, so that's everything I got from Urban Outfitters. So me, just absolutely love that, really love all those items. They're all things that I could wear time and time again, so I don't feel too bad about spending the amount of money that I did. So next on the haul, we've got some items from ASOS. Start off with these. So these are little baby blue Adidas shorts. These are the Adidas shorts that you want in your life, right? So I've got these in black from last year, and I love Adidas, like I've got a lot of Adidas things. I think like it'll just stay around forever. I don't think it will ever go out of fashion. I've got a couple of Adidas shorts that I love but they just don't fit that nice like they're not high-waisted and they're not like as boxy if that makes sense it's not that flattering on whereas these are the good flattering ones they're like high-waisted kind of boxy fit now they've got a wee pocket on the bum this color is just so cute again with a tan and will be ping next up more tie-dye I am ob just with these. They're so, so cute. Like, I love the tie-dye range ready this. It's so ping. Like, actually, look at the colours here. Oh, they're so cute and so girly. I actually adore them. Again, these are the same fit as the last ones. So, I know that they'll be nice and flattering on. And this, I think you just need to keep so simple. Like, white vest. Wee pair of, like, white socks. At Balenciaga's, my cream ones. Scrunchie on your wrist and hair like this or something like that would just be so cute keep all the attention to the shorts because they are speaking for themselves okay so next up i got this wee top i honestly do not know how you pronounce this for the life of me i think it's fiorucci 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 we'll call it that i've got two more of these wee tops and i actually just love them like i love this brand i think the wee angels are just the sweetest little things mm, yeah i just oh i just think this will be stunning on with a tan this is just my black adidas shorts like it's a pure simple look but so cute this stuff is slightly more expensive like it is like a wee designer brand this top was 70 so it is quite dear but uh like my other tops i wear them all the time and i think they're just so cute um, and the quality of it and stuff is really good. Yeah, just think they're so cute, so sweet. Okay, next up for me, sauce, I just got some socks. I think we're all with socks. Well, I'm not buying any shoes at the moment because shoes aren't getting worn that much. So I'm just kind of updating my sock wardrobe. So these were a wee free pack. 
Uh, I've already worn the pink, so that's why they're like this. Pink, blue, green. So they've all just got these wee, like, I don't know what you'd call that. This wee detail at the top, like, ruffled or something. I just love socks. You can never have too many socks. And they're so nice for, like, when you're just wearing trainers and shorts. Wee bit of detail down at the old ankles that I got some pairs of sunglasses. Obviously, these will only be worn in my back garden or to the shops, but why not? Next up, I've got these wee blue numbers. Oh la la! Oh la la! So fancy! Say what? I don't know what I'm saying to be honest. These are like uh, really rectangle. <laughs> I look quite funny. Terminator. They're really rectangle and they're like a kind of see through blue. Oh, hello. But I love them. I think they're so funky. They're definitely a bit of a weird shape, but. Weird is good. Just because I love the shape of the last one so much, I bud them again. And these ones are like pale pink cow print. Oh, so cute. I actually have so much time for these, especially with the pink hair. I think it's real cute. So yeah, just why not sit out in the garden and look hella fresh? Just because we're in quarantine does not mean you should be slacking. Yeah? Sick. Sick, bruv. It's sick. Real fan of these. Oh. Right, these next two items are also from ASOS but they are Nike. So I got this wee top and just love this. It's just so basic, just a wee kind of normal fitting t-shirt. It's like a pure nice pink like fuchsia watermelon really vibing with it. Got the wee tick up here so it's just really simple yet effective. I buy a size small and everything. I'm an 8 so I just buy small and absolutely everything but they only had this left in an extra small. I never buy extra smalls like I've never been an extra small in my life but I really 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 wanted this. I just thought this was a great everyday item. So I thought fuck it I'll just buy the extra small and to be honest I'm glad I did. It fits really nice. It's quite an oversized fit anyway so maybe the small would have been too big. I'm not sure but anyway love that okay next up is this hoodie this speaks to me on a spiritual level i actually love the color of it so much like a purpley but it's like bluey as well i'm not really sure what color you would call this it's a zip a zipper zip up hoodie and to be honest i never wear hoodies with a zip but what a perfect time to start because this wee one is a stunner the sleeves go down really low if you can see that um, it's like dead slouchy, I would describe this as. It's quite a lazy fitting hoodie, but it's really paying. I absolutely love it. I think this sold out pretty quick. Um, this would be great just for like shoving on when it's like kind of cold outside but not cold enough for a jacket. This is your man. Okay, and next uh, few items are some more Nike things. Um, I got these off of the Nike website. These are just some plain black joggies. I never wear black. I feel really weird even buying these but I mean like black joggers. Everyone needs a pair of black joggers. I'll definitely brighten them up. Don't you worry. I just think these look really nice. Just again just basic night tick here. Look like a really good fit. These are loose fit as Nike would say. Last but certainly not least um, I just bought these all on Depop. I just typed in tie-dye socks and these came up. Actually obsessed. How beautiful are these? These are these Nike socks I wear like pretty much every day. Um, but someone skilled enough has tie-dyed them. This is certainly something you can do yourself and save yourself some money because I paid £40 for four pairs. That is such a rip-off but Quite frankly, I'm not skilled enough to do this myself. There's one pair, these are like blue, pink and white. Stunning. Stunning. Actually obsessed with them and I don't care if I get ripped off because they're banging. Next up we have this pair. Uh, these are like purple, pink and white. So beautiful, so girly, really match my hair. Actually just obsessed to be honest. Next up, how sweet. Actually just summer sunset right there. Uh, these are orange, pink and white. Banging, absolutely gorgeous. Love. And last but not least, these are my favourite. These are like a wee pastel rainbow. They are just adorable. Like how sweet are they? So these are like yellow, pink, blue and green. Actually just so gorgeous. I'm so obsessed with these. Right, here comes a tiring bit of hauls. I'll try this all on and show y'all. Oh, crrr, let's kick this thing off with the hoodie. Terribly sorry, it looks like we're a bit out of focus here. Stupid camera, but we're back with a back bend. And I'm on my arse. But when life knocks you down, get straight back up. 
wee piece to my homies. And here's me being a gangster, which to be honest, I think I'd make a pretty bra gangster. The robot, however, could be doing with a wee bit of work, not gonna lie. And here's a wee Mexican wave. Feel free to join in. And yeah, I think that will be enough of the hoodie. Thanks, gal. So here we have a visual representation of how I will be entering and dancing in the SWG3 as soon as lockdown is over. <laughs> um, this wee pose is a personal favourite of mine but I'm not too sure what it is or where I found it. There's me just striking a few poses as H would say and swiveling my hips. By the way, love the word swivel, like it's, it definitely wasn't used enough. Doesn't get enough credit either. Um, but yeah, colours are really popping on this one. Love it. We Y stand. Good save. And I think this is me trying to twerk. Um, yeah, I can't twerk. <laughs> da -na 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 roar! Who is that smooth criminal? Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm mhm. Mm mhm. 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 Wee booty pop, cheeky Megano. <laughs> oh, sexy mamacita. Love this top, love this message. What a vibe, guys. What a vibe. We peace, we yog slipper, we smile. And. And she is back in the lilac vest. I really remind myself of a wee Parma Violet here, or a big Parma Violet, which is really great because I absolutely love Parma Violets. Um, yeah, not a bad word to say about this wee number. Do you know, it's honestly not until I film this stuff that I realise I'm a bit of a fucking weirdo. Why am I stretching? <laughs> Why am I doing that? <laughs> Okay, next up is a little lemon one and I'm looking like a little spring chicken. Love this colour, super, super cute. Shake your chamois. And here's me being super dramatic, just like I am every single day of my life. Lol. Okay, so I'm really looking like I'm about to start some sort of fitness videos in the 90s, but kind of liking it. These wee shorts are so cute, the colour is beautiful. Oh, as the price. Hee hee hee. Okay, here comes this weird pose again. Honestly guys, where did I find that? I'm not sure. Yolle, yolle, yolle. <laughs> I'm trying to sound like Megan the Stallion there, but I don't know if I succeeded. Um, love these shorts, just like butter wouldn't melt. But see, to be honest, they actually remind me of the Ibiza for Sunset, which is really upsetting at the moment. And I just really, really, really miss Ibiza. Don't mind me, just making the grandest of entries as always. Oh, some very ladylike wee posies. Love these wee tops so much, I just think they're so cute. Cropped in all the right places, you know. I look so ill when I try and wink. That's so rude. My mum is going to be really raging at that. Sorry, mum. <laughs> Please do forgive me. Bah! Again. <laughs> Love this top. Look how bright that is. Absolute stunning. Whoopa! 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 <laughs> yep, this is just me demonstrating you can also wear this top tin. But I think I later found I liked it. Yeah. I like it dot out better. Love it. It's so warm doing hauls by the way. Ooh, look at that wee magic trick. Fantastic, Megan. Some real good work there. So I just love this wee hoodie so much. It's such a pretty colour. What is that? Megan, what is <laughs> what is that? That looks quite aggressive. This is it zipped up. <clears throat> Hood up now. And <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Stop whatever you were doing and look at these joggies. Haha. <laughs> oh, just moving the camera so you can see them a wee bit better. Thank you, Megan. Alrighty. Oh, that's a wee bit inappropriate. <laughs> 
really love these. They're dead slouchy and like a wee bit too big to be honest, but still super swaggy, tap dancing. Okay guys, you'll just need to bear with me here because I'm still really new to the foot modeling world and I'm still working on my skills, but here is me showing off those beautiful Nike socks. Um, I really hope for your sake that you seen my stories on Instagram the other day about my really pointy feet. Like, I'm not joking, I should be in the Guinness Book of Records with these darts of mine. Like, see when people first see my feet, they're taken aback. Like, they're so pointy, like, words can't explain. So, like I said, I hope you've seen my story. But yeah, even these socks look absolutely stunning on my rather unique feet, shall we call them. I'm proud of my feet, like, they're different, but they're good. Oh my god guys, you actually have no idea how tiring and how sweaty and how hot it gets trying to film a haul that many outfit changes. Whew. Look at the board moving the tripod back, I just don't have the energy. But yeah, that finishes up the haul. Um, if you're wondering where £500 went, <laughs> that was where. Yeah, I hope you all enjoyed. Um, thanks so much for watching and I should see you next week um, if I stick to this. Bye!